it's really hard. It's a sacrifice. It's an enormous sacrifice. Um, as a young writer, you've got to be willing, happy, actually happy, to give the next 10, 15 years of your life to writing, whether or not you sell anything. You will drive a taxi or clerk in a hotel, do whatever it is to, to, to pay the rent, <clears throat> but, but you've got to write, and you, and you have to realize that the first things you write are the worst things you'll ever write. And 10 years from now, you'll look back on the stuff you're writing now, and you'll see how amateurish it was. But you had to write to get it out and to move to the next and to the next and the next and learn and get better and better at it. And if you're dedicated, you've got talent, you will get better and better until you finally reach a point where people read what you've written and go, wow, that's true. And so, um, and so the, there's, a, there's a tendency... Um, that if the first thing I write does not sell, I quit. And uh, those people are not artists. Those people, in my judgment, are dilettantes. And if you, if you can't sell the first thing you write, so what? You learn. Now you do the second thing. And, and in terms of persistence, by the way, I don't mean to keep beating the dead horse of the same screenplay year after year after year. That's not persistence. That's, that's, that's a kind of insanity. You keep doing the same thing over and over, expecting a different result. You take the screenplay or the play or the novel you're writing and rewrite to the, the best you can. If, if it doesn't work for other people, then you move to your next and your next and your next and your next. A writer is not somebody with a story to tell. A writer is somebody with stories to tell. And so you tell different stories and, uh, and, and progress. And so, um, and so don't quit, but don't beat the same screenplay to death for year, years on end. Uh, tell stories the best you can until you master the art form, um, and um, hopefully you'll find your success.